in late Lyme disease. And I, I showed you the picture with the red eye. Mm -hmm. And with, with this picture you can explain what happens in the small vessel, vessels of the eye. Because here you have, you have a model of a, of a vessel. And this is the outer collagen tissue. You have a muscle uh, tissue. You have the inner collagen tissue and you have the endothelial cells which are inside of the vessel. And what is happening in Borrelia infection? By the tick bite, when the tick, the, sagt man, der Stachel, comes directly in a vessel, the bacterium is directly after the bite, some hours after the bite, able to go through the whole body. It makes a promenade through the whole body. But then the microorganism knows that in some weeks antibodies are coming and the bacterium has tendons to go out of the blood. It goes through, the, it is a bearing bacterium. Borrelia are bearing bacteria. They are able to, to transpire the endothelial cell. And then it arrives in this inner layer, which is a collagen layer. And the illness happens here. And this was also one question. Yeah, when we, uh, when we substitute the blood, can we treat effective the treatment? To my opinion, not, because when you take out the blood and substitute it, you cannot take out those bacteria which have settled in this layer. May I ask you, is it therefore PCR doesn't work in late yeah, stage exactly, of life? Exactly, exactly. You look in the blood for Borrelia and you don't find it because, because the bacterium uh, even in the first days of the, after the infection it, go, it has tendons to go out of the bloodstream. It goes in the, in the small vessels, it goes in the tissue. It can also later go through the whole vessel wall, then it goes in for example. It was found intracellular in collagen um, cells, also collagen cells, yeah. and it was also found in endothelial cells. And you even can culture it intracellular in, in, in endothelial cells. May I ask you one uh, question? Uh, uh, yeah. Is this a bigger problem? than biofilm and round bodies? It's both, all three are great problems. Okay. Because the next thing is the bacterium, and I can show you the literature, Borrelia bacterium has uh, enzymes with which they are able to destruct collagen tissue. And you see, collagen tissue is a uh, ein, uh, a protein which is normally okay. uh, difficult to break but Borrelias have an enzyme to destruct the collagen tissue and then little holes are resulting and in these holes they are growing up in colonies and they produce her slime around them yeah. then you Biofilm. have you have the perfect biofilm, but the biofilm in is in this inner layer of the smallest vessels. And it, they grow up in colonies. You give an antibiotic, you, you target the outer ones of the biofilm, microorgan bacteria, but not the inner. And this is also a reason why you must do so long treatment. Excuse and me. How yeah. to kill uh, the bacteria when they are here? Uh, you you told you, me you, you told me one antibiotic yeah, yeah, will yeah, work. Yeah, you, you must give always again. And the medicaments they go here, but they have problems to go in the biofilm. And I okay, show you, okay. 
I show you, excuse me, a model where you can imagine what happens in when, excuse me, this you have understood. Okay. This picture which you have done. Yeah, the eye. The eye. Yeah. Then you have learned, oh, these are the small, small vessels which are affected. And now I show you another model of the small vessel. This is in this book. This is a model of a small, small vessel of a capillarity. And here you see the endothelial cells which are inside of our uh, vessels.